I'm gonna piss off so many Sixers fans with this one. Can Simmons and Embiid and the Sixers put their pride aside, put the beef aside, and win an NBA championship back in Philly? Or will the beef consume them and they'll do nothing? Not like they've been doing anything in the first place. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Okay, all right, all right. That's the only shot I'm taking. We put Simmons and Embiid on a six year deal, so they're not going anywhere. And I put Simmons at power forward, so Embiid has no space in the work just like he had for six years. So it's all gonna work out just fine. Can Luka just go one year without doing this? Well, there's Harden and Embiid on second team. Luka made all defensive. Like, what are we doing? And it looks like Ben being added back to the team is helping out a lot. But they've had this row before and they, you know, got beat out by Trey Young. Now they gotta beat Washington. Ooh, you gotta watch out for Kuzma. He's good at basketball and stuff. Well, I guess he's not good enough because that's gonna be a sweep. And I guess that means there's no beef so far. All is going well. Well, if Ben's only gonna take eight shots a game, I mean, he's, he's just limiting himself. He's kind of just, you know, doing his, he's doing his job. Now we got a tough matchup in the Chicago Bulls. Well, I'll give him a shot, but it's not looking too good. And beating the post, Ben Simmons sitting in that dunker spot. We know the short corner. It looks like in crunch time, they just avoid completely completely giving Ben Simmons the ball, which I can understand. Maybe I should have traded away Harden because <laughs> it looks like Embiid's got his new buddy. Hey, Harden, why don't we run some action for Ben? Maybe it'll piss off Embiid. No, they're just going to keep feeding Embiid. Embiid, I see Ben wide open for three. Oh, okay. Actually kicked out to a shooter. Wow, that was actually a really nice pass. Listen, man, I got six years to just Hall of Fame instigate beef, so I'm just going to keep doing it. Embiid going to post up yet again. Uh, it just... No one's gonna double and Embiid going up with the hook smoked it. See that right there is why you don't go to Embiid in the clutch. You just you gotta give it to Ben. And I think Ben and Embiid are gonna have a long hard talk about that play after they lose this game seven. I say on the beef scale we're like at a two out of ten right now. Ben's not too happy he didn't get the ball one time in crunch time and Embiid just took you know he took some rough shots. I mean not really he had an open shot he just kind of missed it. But you know he, we're instigating you get the point. And also typical Sixers losing in the second round just nothing new happening and uh, the Cavs just again the, the new algo winning the championship. I just thought about this. Hopefully, they don't trade Simmons. <laughs> That'll be really bad. Okay, listen. We have to see how high the beef scale gets. Year two of instigating beef. I mean, things are looking good. I will eventually move Ben Simmons out of the dunker spot once Harden just keeps getting worse. And then maybe we'll move Ben back to point guard. But I like what we got right now. Let's keep at it. All right, Luca, back to back years. Congrats. Maybe Luca will make another defensive team. Is that what's going to happen here? Oh, he made. I, I, I don't get it. Sixers, second seed. Ooh, they got their arch nemesis, the Bulls. Not really nemesis. They just lost to them last time. I don't know. You get the point. I don't know, man. If I was Ben Simmons, I'd be a little mad right now. I'm only getting up 13 shots a game and Bede's getting up 19. I don't like the discrepancy, man. Has Chicago changed at all? They have no, they got Clint Capel now. All right, well, this is going to be a sweep. I'm not even going to go to the Simcast. Oh, of course, of course, they just take a game. That's great. We got our art. Okay, these are actual arch rivals. Okay, we will not really. You, Trey Young versus Embiid and Ben Simmons. It's, it's, it's like flashing. He's getting PTSD right now, which I understand. And look at Embiid and Simmons breaking the conference finals curse. I don't know if they're going to beat the Algo, though. That, this is going to be tough. This has the potential to be some very good beef. Oh, wait. Ben Simmons isn't even in the game. Did he foul out? If he didn't foul out, that means Embiid purposely put him on the bench. Okay, no. He's got six fouls. I was going to say, I was, was going to start a little bit of beef. I didn't want to say anything. But this is their ticket to the NBA Finals. And if Embiid somehow messes this up, oh, man. Ben Simmons is not going to be happy. Because I'm assuming he got those fouls because Embiid couldn't stay on his man, and Ben Simmons had to come play help defense, and he ended up fouling a lot. So, and if a B can't act upon that, then, I mean, listen, man, the beef scale is just gonna keep, that's a crazy shot. God, watching him beat shoot free throws just pisses me off. We haven't watched basketball in too much. I just forgot how much that man foul baits. It is the most annoying thing to watch unless you're a Sixers fan. Maybe that's why Ben Simmons left. I just, listen, bro, I, I'm, I'm putting up everything to speculation, man. Now, they're just gonna post up and beat. It looks like every single time, they just, oh, they're getting double team. Maxi, clutch. That's not going in. Okay, that was close though. Well, I gotta be honest here. I'm kind of disappointed. I'm obviously here to actively hate watch and just like I can't really make up nothing of it. They're going to the finals and they gotta play the other team. 2K likes the Pelicans, of course. Well, it looks like they're on their way to a ring. It's gonna be very hard to create some beef here. Maybe we could have like a Kobe Shaq type thing where it's like, man, like I don't even care about the winning. Like I just hate you. You know what I'm saying? Like maybe we could do something like that. All right, well, somehow a two point game. If they actually come back here and win this and then just like win every game after that, that'd be really cool. There's two seconds left. What are you doing? Herbert Jones. Jones lay up on Thibel and it's off. I just like, what the hell was that? And Bede's crying because he just realized he won a championship with Ben Simmons. Okay. Yeah. All right. I, I can build on that. I, I I can build on that. No, I got to be honest. The beef scale right now, it's out of one out of 10, man. I got I, I got to be real. I mean, you won the championship. Yeah, listen, man, winning cures all, as they say. James Harden won finals MVP. He's making this team too overpowered. You need to get off this team. Like, I just want to see Simmons and Embiid fail just so they beef. Is that bad? Like, that's like, that's like S tier instigating. I'm, I'm sorry. I, listen, bro. It, it, it's the whole point of the video. 
video. Like, I'm here to actively hate watch. I apologize. I mean, at least Harden's getting worse every year. Should we just move Simmons the point guard now? I feel like he might start. At least now Ben will get the ball in prime time and he'll make decisions on if he actually wants to give Embiid the ball because we have yet to actually see Embiid pass the ball to Simmons or vice versa. I really want Embiid to win MVP or better yet if Ben Simmons won it. That would really start something, but Luca's just going to keep taking it. Harden, like, why is he so OP, bro? Can you stop being good at basketball for like two seconds? Like, we won 62 games. Like, we're not supposed to be this good, which means obviously we're the first seed. We got Miami. That's a little kryptonite right there. Not really. I don't know why I just said that. I mean, they, we, we're one and one in the past like five years. All right, so what did Ben average now? He averaged 18. Okay, that's not bad. 18 and four or 18 and eight. I can't do math. And he's still taking that 13 shots a game. How many shots is B taking? He's taking 19 still. Listen, bro. Listen, Ben, you got to get mad about something, man. Come on. All this winning isn't helping anybody. Well, we got Cam Johnson. I wouldn't mind Cam Johnson on the team. That's a good addition. We just haven't been able to find a consistent power forward for about four years now, so that would help out. Well, I guess Cam Johnson didn't really help out that much. It's over in five. Now we got the Pacers, who are somehow just really good now. Well, never mind. I guess uh, Philly's just a juggernaut now. I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. And it'd be just going stupid. Oh, my God. Now we got Toronto with the Twitch streamer. If we, I mean, listen, we're going to be the Twitch streamer, bro. It's literally 3-0 right now. Like what, like, what am I supposed to do with any of this? Like, am I supposed to gain something? Like, can I, I can't hate watch this. They're literally winning every series. And now they got to play Houston. How is this team already ready to contend for a championship? And this series is 3-0-2. Like, like, literally, like, what am I supposed to do? Y'all got a game. That's great. Can you get two? Okay, we can actually hop into this. All right, this is the moment we've been waiting for. And also, Hart is not going to be in the game because he's the sixth man. So it's going to come down to Ben Simmons and Embiid to work together to somehow not blow a 3-0 lead right now. Embiid, he don't know what to do. He's Oh, he's got Maxi wide open. Wow, Maxi's been clutch, bro. Oh my god, Embiid, there's no way he just shot that. That's a crazy shot. I'm not gonna lie, I think Embiid just trolled in game seven. I actually genuinely think that was a troll shot. Jalen Green, no. Oh my god, Jalen Green is selling. They're just gonna keep trying to feed Embiid in the post, which I guess I can respect. Uh, that's a nice hook shot, and he smoked it. Embiid is trolling. Oh my god! Wait a second, are they faking beef? Are they both trolling the fake beef just to like fuck with me? Like what's what, what's the situation here? Ben Simmons in game seven of the finals. Maybe take a step back three. I'd like that. That'd be a good shot. Oh my Okay, alright, no, nah, I'm getting trolled. No, they're, they're trolling on purpose. They're, they're trolling on purpose. They must have supreme confidence they can win this, which I don't know why. You're down forward 25 seconds, no timeouts. Ben Simmons waiting to post up and beat yet again and B just okay, double team. Oh, oh my god. I don't even know if I can assign this as beef because Ben's obviously trolling and Embiid's also obviously trolling. Again, I, I don't know if this is collusion. I think Maxi's pissed now. <laughs> if, if I were Maxi, I'd be pissed. But I gotta be honest, I think the beef scale is still at a one. Like, I, I, I just, I think that was on purpose. I don't think they genuinely were trying to win that basketball game. So I, I gotta just give that up to them trolling. I'm not gonna lie, I'm tired of there being no beef in my beef video. If there's any way to make beef, it's definitely raising Ben Simmons' shot tendencies from three. This is definitely going to cause problems. Well, no difference here. I think me making Ben Simmons' tendencies is harder. Like, uh, I think that might have affected this. Simmons averaged 12 a game. That is not a lot. How many threes did he take a game? He took... <laughs> he took... <laughs> Wow, that's a lot of threes. I feel like Lamelo's just about to smoke him right now. Well, they smoked him in this game, but at least they kept it the semi-competitive going the six games. And Bead shot two for 16. This was on purpose. Okay, all right. The beef scale is up to about four out of 10. This was a purposeful loss. Ben Simmons was trying to win. He made three threes. He was three for six and three. He was trying to win this game. And the Pacers, uh, I just want to make this known. We had a Pacers-Kings finals. You'll never see that in your life. I'm very surprised Simmons did not get traded yet. Like, that's just like the most shocking part here. And they both got two years left. This team like kind of sucks now unless Maxi just starts taking over. But yeah, this team's kind of ass. All right, bro. Just win it every year, bro. Just go ahead. All right. Philly's in the playing tournament now. I don't know if like the Ben Simmons just got bored or something, but like they're just like not winning anymore. They won 38 games. Like it's even kind of the mick for them to even beat her. I just said the mick just in a non or in an unironic way. But uh, Ben having a pretty good year for himself. Still shooting 25% from three. He's really bad. I really killed this team with that, didn't I? That was that. That was the downfall. And they beat Cleveland, so they're going to the playoffs. They got to beat Cade and Victor in the first shot. And it's a good ass team. Yeah, and they're about to get slapped. Listen, bro, these last few years have not been good. This is looking like the fallout, man. It's looking tough. Why does Embiid just keep shooting terribly in elimination games? Is that like, is he doing that on purpose for more beef? Listen, I appreciate it. I'm enjoying the hate watching right now. I was not enjoying the first three years of the simulation. Why are the Pacers just like so good? They just keep getting to the finals. James Harden said, I'm, yeah, I'm calling it quiz, bro. I'm done with this team. He's over it. Oh, so I guess one more hurrah season to see if they can win at all. I mean, probably not again. The team sucks. Oh, I guess they had Maxi and now they have Edwards. Okay, just a little trade off there. So now the Pacers just got Luka and Embiid's done. 
not make an NBA team, which makes sense. He's like an 80 overall. But look at Ben Simmons' defensive teams. Oh, they like didn't make the playoffs. Okay, that's a great way to end this off. Well, I guess we're done here. If I had to rate this beef overall, I'd say three out of ten. That game seven felt like collusion. I didn't. I don't think that was real beef. And I think if B was slightly content with being ass the last three years. Let me know down in the comments who we should have beef next. Goodbye.